pretty people welcome back to my channel today i'm bringing you all a review video so i was sent this binder and photo cover stuff from uniki they reached out to me they said hey you want to get some stuff and i was like oh this is like right on time because i kind of been trying to go through a different type of organization for my dolls so i was like oh, okay yeah i'll try it out and see what it's about so they sent me some sheets protective sheets which go inside the binder and then they gave me their binder and the binder is a little different the binder has like plastic closures versus like your metal ones that you get in your standard you know binders but anyway i'm gonna show you all of that as i open this up so as you can see we're just digging right into it girl so they have different types of sheets so if you're looking for any specific type of um protective sleeve these are the types that they have so this one i believe i got the photo sheet protector the four by six which is like three sections and then like a little one which is kind of probably gonna be good because I have some dolls. All I'm thinking about is my doll organization here. But I have some dolls that are just one. So that would be kind of cute for that, don't you think? So you get, how many is this? Cause this seems like a lot. Uh -huh. Does it tell me how many? It doesn't. Let me count it real quick. Girl, so I halfway counted it. I think it's 50. <laughs> but that's a lot of sheets. So 50 times three, that's like $150. Okay, so we're just going to put that to the side for now. But anywho, so I got the sheets and then, oh, they're just falling. They're just, they're just going to fall to the ground. So this is their binder. So it's really different, right? It has a closure on it. This is the closure, two little snaps here. Just unsnap those and then it just opens right up. Now, I'm thinking that when you get your binder that it comes with like a sample pack of sheets because it does have like the little one page sleeve. Then it has one that has like a little flap closure on there. So they have all types of different sleeves which is really nice it just depends on what you want to use it for then you have like your little nine three six nine which is probably for like um what is that called like those trading cards or something like that so you get a couple of those but yeah so they give you like all types of different ones to test out so that was really neat there and then you can also change out this cover so they gave me a cover that just says arts and crafts scrapbooking but if i wanted to do something special i could so isn't that really neat so what's so different about these is that they're like they're like plastic but what i think is going to be great about this is i don't know if y'all notice in your binders how sometimes when you're flipping all right so here's the binder and as it gets so thick, like sometimes your pages get caught. It's not getting caught right now, but you know how that works, right? And sometimes you get a little gapping. So I'm wondering if with this plastic closure, if it prevents that from happening. That would be really neat. So anyway, back to this. So it is like you do have to put like a little, like, it's not like an easy, like, just pull it up like that. You do have to kind of yank it, but it's not breaking nothing. You just yank it open and it's good to go. So that's really cool there. So we're just gonna see how these go in here. Is it right side up? Okay. So this, this is gonna be cute. So I'm just gonna put a couple in there and just give y'all the idea of where I'm going with this. So with my dolls, I, sometimes share <laughs> i do sometimes share with the girls because oh wait hold on is that hard is that hard to do 
Okay, hold on. Okay, it did it, but it was a little struggle there. Okay, girl. So yeah, we, we you know got tested out for the right the right things. Okay. So this is what I have my dolls in now. It's just a photo album, and it fits three to a thing. So they're about the same in height. So that's cool. So let's just see how this is going to work. So the one thing that I do like about photo albums is that, not photo albums, excuse me, binders, is that you just, you could just fill in as you want to, right? Versus in the photo albums, you have to kind of, you know, maneuver. So I like alphabetical order. So instead of me having to switch them out, I can just get an extra sheet and put it in between. You know what I mean? So that's really, this is actually really cute. Okay. I didn't know if I was going to like it or not. <laughs> but they fit really good in there. Yeah, they fit really good. So what I'm going to show you is on this one, you have a little sleeve there. So let's see. So I just have a doll. Is she going to be too tall? She might be too tall, you guys. Let's see. Oh, I could just cut the um the top of it off and she'll fit fine. So that's fine. I don't mind cutting stuff. So we're just filling that in there. Okay. So that's that's a little oh y'all didn't girl, we ain't even in frame. My bad. Y'all know me. I just be all over the place, but that's kind of cute. Let me cut the top of that real quick so I can give y'all exactly how it will work. I don't remember her name. I feel like I was looking for her, but I can't remember her name. So we just cut it down a little bit and she fits right in there. Okay, look at her. And so just easily just flip through, girl, and find your your doll okay i kind of like this and then we just close it right back up they safe and secure ain't no coming out of there boo you can do all this shake 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 let's see what happens shake 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 it open her back up you know with the binder you know your your stick is on the floor at this point <laughs> okay so yeah they would have been on the floor but they not because they in this little enclosed binder <laughs> so really cute i really like it so that is that i could just fill this up i'll probably fill it up later on tonight so that i can just have it and i think what i'm gonna do is i'll just put a whole lot of little die cuts and stuff on here really you could just slide you some dolls in there without um cutting them like look you could just go like this real quick we're just going to do something. Yep, there she go. Dolls are so really cute. So, again, thank you so much, Unikeep, for reaching out to me about this new little binder. I think it's really neat. I really like how it's closed. I really like that about it because you could just really just stack it. Like, you could just stack a whole lot of these and do what you need to do. That's really cute. So... Thanks again for reaching out to me to review this. I give it an 8. I give it an 8 just because the little... Just because these, they, they're not the easiest to open and close. But, I mean, that's good in the long run. So, I'm not going to give you less than that because it's good. <laughs> so, yes, you guys, I, I like it. So, anyway, I'll leave all the links and stuff to these people below and even if you don't want this binder itself i think the sleeves are really good they're good quality and i think it's it's really cute how you know you have that one doll that you could just stick to the side right there i like that a lot so that is it y'all i hope you enjoyed this quick little review video if you did go ahead and give me a thumbs up and if you want to see more from me go ahead and hit that subscribe button so that you're notified on the next video and i'll talk to you in the next one bye